shoot, bro. I wasn't even. I thought I was typing it. I thought I was talking the whole time. My mic was muted. <laughs> but um, you see by the title, aerial drift build. A lot of people been asking me to come up with another drift build, so told me to surprise them. So um, here we have it, the aerial nomad drift build. Uh, pretty. I actually kind of like this car. It's pretty much been my favorite car for the last couple of days since I made it. If anybody's been in my server and seen me drifting around having fun with this car. Um, I'll see I'm going to start off with the tune first for you guys. <coughs> I don't want to watch the video and just skip and get the tune. Um, here we go. Engine stage 3. Turbocharging stage 3. Brakes, race, weight, race reduction, tires, drift, obviously. You're drifting, transmission, race, suspension, running 0, 1500, tw uh, 1250. Uh, 1456 100 0 1500 1250 uh 1250 100 uh will will with i'm running 400 400s i just like the way it looks honestly it doesn't really affect anything will size negative 20 negative 20s only running at so it doesn't peek through this like i said doesn't really affect anything it's just the way my personal look camber 83 83 to give it the straight straightness is what it looks like uh, offset I'm running 500 500 obviously push it all the way out um, I just like the way it looks steering uh, my steering tune pretty much for all my drift cars uh, 65 280 90 105 50 50 10 750 500 186 <coughs> drivetrain running rear wheel drive differential differential I'm running 70 20 20 and gearing are running 3.17 um you definitely want to drift this car in semi you want to drift this car in semi and uh you want to <laughs> you want to drift this car yeah you want to put it in semi you want to keep it in second and third gear first gear doesn't really perform really well second gear and third gear is where it's at you want to use semi and um you want to press P obviously to help you with drifting. P is parking brake. Oh, actually another thing I forgot to tell y'all. This is actually really important. Um, I just remembered. This is actually really important. Y'all want to do. Um, kind of been working on brake biases kind lately to understand what brake bias does, since no one really, you know, told me what brake bias does. But you want to put your brake bias to forty. The only reason why I'm saying that is because you put your brake bias to 40. It will. I, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. Under, I don't know how to explain it, but I pretty. I'll probably make a video in the future talking about brake bias. But I kind of been trying to figure it out what what it doesn't mean because I've never seen anybody do anything with brake bias. And brake bias actually helps really well with drift builds. So I'm going to be showing, probably make another video about that in the future. But you want your brake bias to be 40 if it's not already. Yeah, 40. Yeah, you want your brake bias to be 40 for this car. Uh, it will help you in a process of turning and drifting and braking. Um, but uh, yeah, I would definitely make a video about brakes, brake bias, brake bias in the future to help explain it further. Um, it's really important. So I'm going to be running three tracks. If you know my drift builds already, I'm going to be running the Sussies track. I'm going to be running this Cafe track, and I'm going to be running Lasto's track that he made. <laughs> just to show you how it performs in each track uh, I'm also going to be using the TR's version Well, I'm going to be using mine's and TR version put together of the Sussies track uh, Shout out to my boy TR um, But uh, let's get this started So like I said, second year you can, you can also drift this in first person if you didn't know You can also drift it in first person I've tried it, it's definitely a little bit harder But it's fun when you get the hang of it but um, all right, let me show you how it performs. Parking brake right there. I like zoom in a little bit. I like I like to drift in a certain way. My camera has to face a certain way for me to drift. All right, I'm messing up. This is bad performance by me. Let me tee up now. now I'm so sorry. My first time drifting all day. Okay, hold on, 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 hold on. Hold on. I'm not about to make a video like this. Hold on. Hold on. Give me one second, y'all. Let me tee up. Let me tee up. Let me tee up. Let me tee up. Let me concentrate. Let me tee up. All right, let's go. Put it in the third right there. I'm going to break 
break right here. Put it back to second. Break, break, break. Let it go in there. I'm gonna break right here. Swing it around. Break again. Swing it around. Break. Break right here. Break. Break. Well, parking brake pretty much. When I say break, I'm doing a parking brake. I'm gonna park and break. Swing it into third. Park and break again. Swing it around. Break. Break. I'm gonna break again. You can keep it maxed out floor here. Keep it like this. Uh, keep it into second right here, honestly. Break, break. I'm gonna break right here at the arrow. Just let it slide. I messed up a little bit. I'm gonna break at the arrow again. I'm gonna break right here. Let it slide around. I'm gonna break at the arrow right here. Push it out. Keep it into second gear. You can kind of throw it into third, break, throw it into third like that. Need more angle. Keep it into third, bring it back down to second. Break. You know, you can floor it all the way here. Just keep turning. Keep flooring it, keep flooring it. Break right there. And it break coming out. Swing it back around. Kind of messed up there. I looked at the chat. Well, not the chat, but I looked at my recording. Uh, I messed up there as well, but I'm gonna break right there. Right here, you wanna break coming at that arrow. Break the gate. So get back around. Right here, you wanna break. Come in close. You wanna get as close as the trash can as possible. Break, break. Break again. Break. I'm gonna show you all the time I break. Break right there. I'm gonna put it into third gear right here. Break. So adjust it again. I'm gonna break, slide it through. Third gear, keep it in third. Break coming down so it slides. Hit it back into second. It's kind of hard to keep it on here. Do it the best you can. Uh, keep it into second gear. Break right there. Break right there to swing it back. Break again. You can swing it into third gear. Break coming out to swing it around. I messed up a little bit. And then, boom. That's pretty much the track. Me and TR are split together. Next, we're going to be showing you the cafe, which is a little bit more difficult than this one. Honestly, cafe might be... Um, nah, they're pretty much... I think sussies might be a little bit difficult than cafe. I'm not really sure. Uh, so I've, been, I've been talking to Spring Bay, Florida. They got a new map coming. Uh, they got a new map they just got, so... Hopefully, Spring Bay, you know, is out by the end of the month. Uh, hopefully, we can get Spring Bay. Alright, uh, so I'm gonna start this off. Third gear. I'm gonna break, let it slide, break, break, hold it. Second gear, break, bring it in. I'm gonna break right here, let it slide. Break again, let it slide. Then I break, let it swing around. Keep doing it, break, let it slide. Break. Break right there, let it slide again. Keep the loop, keep the break right here, swing it back around. Right here, keep doing it. Third gear, break. Right there, let it slide. I kind of messed up there. Take like back into second gear. Bring it all the way around. You want to break right here, break. Load into first gear. Let it swing around like that. Second gear. Swing it back around. Break. Keep it, keep it going, keep it going. Gonna, well, I messed up a little bit. Break, bring it down here. You wanna get there, break, let it slide, break again. Break, let it slide around. Keep going, break, break again. Like this. Nice. Break it around, slide, put it into third gear. Let it slide around. Nice, nice, nice. Break. Break. Break again. Second gear. Break. Let it slide. Break in. First gear. You can put it back into second. Coming out. Just coming out of here. Break. Put it into third. You want to break before you put it into third. Break. Put it into second. Break. Go around twice. Nice coming out of here. Break. Break right here. Break. 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 Break
break. Break. Box. I'm gonna break right here, throw it into third gear. Oh, I messed up, but I messed up. But oh, you wanna break right there, throw it into third gear. Uh, supposed to be in third gear right now. You got my boy last though, I believe. Break, keep it in third gear all the way along here. Just break right there, start to slide. Just play around right here if you want to. Break. Second gear come out and that's uh that's pretty much cafe i'm gonna show y'all one more which is uh last those track which is all the way near uh dealer one second and we'll show y'all one more and then um yeah I'm pretty much call it but this is the aerial nomad definitely be one of my favorite cars kind of hard kind of easy trying to mess with the second and third gear you definitely need the third gear sometimes for some of these turns <laughs> yeah, that was last though, cause that's cause that's Zerlin right there. Okay. Bro, I didn't even hit anything. I didn't even hit anything. Definitely not easy to control. Alright, so this is um this is the last little track right here. Uh you start from you can pretty much start from anywhere. I like to start from right here. Uh obviously traction, second gear, and then go from there. Uh semi. Press M and then shift up. You don't know, you know how you do the semi? No. <laughs> you press M and Q and E is to shift up or down. E is to shift up, Q is to shift down. So you're starting first. No. It depends on the car. Yeah, M. To switch it into semi mode or manual. Yeah, manual mode. Alright, start from here. Swing it around, break. Uh huh. Me, yeah. Right, swing it back around. Keeping it to second, coming through. You gotta break right here. Break right here. Break. Let it slide. Break it, swing it around. Break right here, swing it back. I'm gonna break at the blue car. Uh, I kind of break a little bit. I'm gonna break a little bit before the blue car right there. Before you come, like, come in there's a stop sign. I'm gonna break at this arrow right here that you're gonna see me break at. Swing it around. I'm gonna break pretty much coming to the tree. Slide it in here. Break obviously. Swing it in. Break. Break again. Slide it around. Keep it. Keep it. Keep it. Keep it. Keep it. Break right there. Kind of broke a little bit too much, but you want to go into here now. Break at that line. Break coming into the tree shadows. And break coming into the Porsche. Swing it back around. Put it into third gear. Break. Slide out. Put it back into second. Swing it back around. Swing it in. Break. 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 Put it back into second gear. I messed up. I didn't mean to put it in the first, but keep it in the second right there. And uh, boom, that's pretty much the last those track. Um, I'll probably show y'all one more track actually. Four tracks. I'm gonna go to unemployed. Um, and we're gonna start and we're gonna do this final track right here. Uh, we're gonna run the uh, spawn track. I can see how it performs on this. But it's actually pretty good. It's actually it's fun to do. Op open wheels is always fun to me. Watching the wheels. 
Um, so you can see him in, he turns the steering wheel and actually shifts inside as well. If you want to do inside, I don't think it, that doesn't pull parking brake, but it shifts inside as well. So if you want to do first person, you can see your character shifting, wheels turn out here, your wheels turn, hand turn in the wheel. So, all right, start from here. Swing it out. Brake right here. Brake, go into third gear. I messed up, but bring it in. Second gear. Slide, brake. Bring it around. Alright, you want to go into here. want to brake right here. Go into third. Coming out. Again, going into second gear, coming through here. I'm gonna put this there. I'm gonna put the gas pedal right there. Brake. I'm gonna brake, coming to the second tree. I'm gonna brake, kind of leaving down. Brake, let it slide. Coming out. Up, but I'm gonna do that again. Do it one more time. I messed up. Come out. Slide down here. Right here, you can honestly keep it in a second. Just break, let it slide. pretty much the aerial nomad it also can do 360 drifts uh the videos are already pretty much long if i want to make it any longer it can definitely do 360 drifts as well but other than that yeah that's the aerial nomad drift tune hope you guys enjoy this i'm gonna have some more cooking i know some of you guys missed the drift builds and uh yeah catch y'all boys in the next one uh peace out <laughs>